All right, hey everyone, Wanderbots here, and welcome to Iris Fall. It's like a creepy puzzle-ish game, uh, and that's about all I know about it. So let's just get started. This is gonna be a quick look. Let's try thing. I love the style though. Mm -hmm. Oh, nightmares! It's a bad cat. Well, it's like a cat within her shadow. It's a, a bad a Muppet. A puppeteer? A doll? No, no, look. This is, are those strings? She is the puppet. I might have to turn down the volume. These would be loud. Is a black cat. Oh, is she in an orphanage? There are several beds. I wouldn't be surprised, as with all semi horror situations. Eh, maybe not. She might just have siblings. Eh, who knows? There are too many beds. It was like ten beds. He's leading her into a shop? Well, I've seen enough series of unfortunate events to know that this is yet another unfortunate event. Crossed with some kind of persona, persona horror nonsense. Oh. Yeah. It's 3D? Yep. I think it's like 2.5D to some degree, but I don't fully know. Well, those are definitely 3D models. Oh, there's a book with an eye on it. And there's definitely the eye symbol etched into the walls. Now, there's a, is that a moon? Moonlight? I think it's an adventure game, actually, now that I'm thinking about it. Oh, see, the cat became a shadow and would use the shadow to cross the beam. There was a... a sprint button, or nope. Cutscene! Oh, is that going to crumble? Aww. Is that a doll that looks like her? Yep. Man, who's leaving all these magic books around? <laughs> I grab one and just like bop it to myself. Keep it with you? Contrast. That was the game. Okay, so for starters, okay, there's this, there's a move faster button. It is called just getting past that section. It looks like you can't interact with the doll. Yeah, I can interact with that thing, but I've got a. Oh, you can climb up there using the book. Yeah, is there a way to move these things though? Uh, well, that's the shadow. So let's climb up the shadow to the other book. Oh, I see. We need the extra pipe bit. That's a big pipe bit for this little girl to just. <laughs> Inventorize. And then that should create the attachment necessary for you to get up. Uh, what? Selected in your inventory. Oh, I see. I had to drag. I had to press left. Mm -hmm. and then you can use that book. Yep. Visual perspective is throwing me for a bit of a loop. Hello. I like how it's black and white with the exception of there's a the it's little bit it's of like sepia, but whatever the grayscale blue scale sepia. We look around. Is this there's flags? There's it looks like a carnival setup almost. Uh, a Dolls. play. This is like where you put on plays for children. A seesaw. <gasps> Ooh. Books. I won't have what you're cooking. I would like to leave now. Farewell. See you later. There's a mask and another book. Like a gear thing. You need to wait the other side by the looks of it. Yeah. But does it just... Oh, I see. It's just a wait. Mm-hmm. 
So that allows you to climb up there. There's this, but this is... Oh, this there's is another a book. jumbled horror mess that... Yeah, no. You're gonna fall on those spikes if you try going on that side. Is it just me or are we moving oh. slower than her, oh. like, run cycle? can you extend that thing? No, I can't interact with them. See how there's, like, the white dots? What's that? Oh. Yeah, those are buttons. You have to move them appropriately. Mm. Yeah, move the other ones. You want them to have the spikes down. So maybe they have to be in the third position. Or that works. That covers it so that you won't fall on spikes. That begs the question of if you tried to cross it, would it prevent you from crossing or would it show your shadow having a grizzly Death. device? Uh, is that a moth or a bat? It's a shadow show. Cats don't like shadows. Because I don't have them. It seemed to Have you ever live... seen a cat and a shadow in the same place at the same time? Didn't think so. But look, the, the cat didn't return. It didn't emerge. The moth did something to it. Spooked it. Gave it the old spookle and it ran away. Oh, I see. We're supposed to... You know those, like, weird hooks? Mm -hmm. We're supposed to hang Put the dolls, dolls off of that. Dolls, why not just like random garbage in here? There's a lot that's probably heavy enough. Nah, it's to it's to fulfill the play. Man, if I gave this to a kid, they'd have nightmares. Lured reality. Achievement unlocked. Yeah. Oh, it came out. I sent that flying and continued through. Okay. Girl goes on. There's a little girl that goes on the left. I wonder what would happen and if I did it on the right. wrong. Probably would just like yell at me. Uh. Oh, you have to switch the heads, the chests, and the. Oh, there you go. You're putting them in the right position. That looks good. And then the legs. They need to be in an action no, pose. No, arms are in a different position than Really? This. One was down and one was up. Maybe? That's it. No, this is it. Is that the same? Might be the same. Definitely not that. That's... Eh, close. Yeah, that's vaguely close enough. Now, is this guy doing, like, the creepy step? Yeah, in a way. Yeah, there he is. He's creeping. And then... Is that it, though? No, the legs need to be different. See, look at the bend. Or... not? I... I guess I got it. Alright. That's weird that they go from fighting poses straight to powering the door. I guess, why not? Okay, the Faded Theater, that was what it was called. I like the walk animation for the loading screens. I like the visual style for a lot of this stuff. I'm gonna call it Asylum Punk, just because I can't think of any better... <laughs> well, they also use the heavy ink outlines. It reminds me of Psychonauts, actually. Like a lot of the architecture and whatnot. Just the, like, ye. I like all that stack of chairs with the eyes. Yeah. Ugh. Mm. I am sleepy. Is this some kind of chamber? Boiler? What is it? Dunno. We need a, uh... We need a key of some sort to get in, though. Doesn't look like I can get past this. Okay. Well, there's a shadow. Oh, yeah. You can grab the wheel. Uh, I was afraid for a second the wind wind was going to be a problem. Like, can we? Does that allow you to turn the boiler on if you stick the wheel in? I guess. Yeah, I guess it works. They don't really give you a whole lot of, like, Ooh. alternates here. Okay, so we've got fuses. This is a circuit. 
You need to let the electricity pass oh. over. Uh. Do you press a button? Is there a different orientation? Um, you can't. Oh. You can't select the red or the green. There's only two spots that they can plug into. Yeah, well, I tried both and neither worked. I'm assuming that one just because it's doing the right to left thing. And I don't see anything else to even interact with. Um... Maybe there's something else to interact with here? That's what I was saying. Is there a button? Ah, there yeah, we go. I wanted you to put the button. Oh, I see. Okay. So the top circuit needs to connect. No, 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 no. It was definitely the left one. Yeah, that one goes there, and then that one goes up. That works. Now press the red button. What's the difference between this? Oh. That doesn't connect. Yeah, it just doesn't fit. That creates another closed circuit. Mm, no, that's not the one that you want. Snakes and ladders. <laughs> that bypasses a lot. Why don't you do that one on the lower left? Up in that spot. Oh. There we go. Oh, it fizzled out. Oh. It's because you redirected it. It's because this one, yeah. That one redirected it. Well, it goes back down here and then back around, so... Uh... Mm. There we go. Oh. You can crisscross them? Yep. Nice. Whoa. This is more than a little dangerous. Uh, what did we just... Picked up something? I, I guess so. That's not how electricity works. I don't think this little girl even knows or understands electricity. All she knows is there's a cat and she is going to nab it. She's going to burgle that cat. So this is a clockwork chamber. Oh, this is what's hey. gonna happen to you when you disobey the cat. Wait, no, that's another girl. Uh-huh. The with other victim. With a hood? to you. you. Don't catch that cat and burgle it. I would hope that the cat's on your side and it's not trying to lure you into a trap of some sort, but since the cat was a villain in her dream, I want you to close the circuit again, probably. Oh, you already had that? <laughs> yep. That was what fell through the ceiling, probably, right? Do you have a way to extend the sides together. Yeah, I don't really know. Uh, why don't you turn that crank over on the far left? This one? Yeah. yeah. Oh. You need something there first. Yeah, because the gear broke. Probably take it from another component. Can you get that here? No? No, it doesn't look like I can do anything of this. Another sort. A and Y. Oh, A is to crank. Y is to apply something to it. Yeah. And aside from those, that's it. So let's plonk you... it on here and just see what happens. Oh, but look, there's a shadow. Oh, yeah, there is. There's a shadow, so if you turn it, what happens? Oh. Oh. Put it oh, back on. Yeah, 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 sorry. Because I think what you're going to do is you're actually going to succeed in turning the other one. Look, it completed it on the other side. Oh. Weird. 
Oh, because it's a perspective thing. One is closer to the... Mm-hmm. It's the source of the light. Weird. What? Made it, I guess. It's weird. On one hand, as a kid, this would have scared the bejesus out of me. On the other hand, this feels like a game that was probably meant for younger audiences. I just enjoy puzzle games. Also, look! This changes the stairway. Oh, that looks like it works. For now. Hmm. We actually had a feasible route there. But it doesn't... I think it was turned the wrong way previously. Okay, now you'll have to use this one to turn it so that you can get to that book. To that stairway. Thank you. Laces! Oh, there it goes. It's a long way around. Yeah, we're on a nice loop. Oh, the, it's a mannequin that's biking. Oh. Do you see that? That's a foot. It is a foot. It is a big mannequin. So once again, we're manipulating the shadows. Probably want to turn it so that the lower stairway connects to the upper left. That looks good. Oh, I'm good at just pressing buttons and having it work. I almost kind of wish you didn't have to press the button to interact with the book at all. Just kind of step over it and it would do the immediate shift. Uh, do we not get to see the crazy mannequin? No, it looks like we're just continuing onward. Or does it smash through the burnished plates? Uh -oh. To, oh. It doesn't look like it's moving with her. Oh, it's opposite. Yeah, it's the hooded girl. Uh-huh. Oh, wait. The next floor. Here, you want to play? You seem sure. a little bit more engaged than what I'm... Uh, what we're doing in this Is way. Is it just the take a nap. joystick and the A? Yep, pretty much. It is not a hyper-advanced game. You don't need to say it like that. Well, no, it's like... Aww. There's no, like, crazy advanced fighting game. You only need a couple of buttons to play this. I'm a little concerned that the achievement hasn't gone away on our screen. It's okay. It's not being recorded. Mm-hmm. Ah, so he's using the hands of the clock, but it retracts. Oh, that's cool. A retracting a spiral retracting. staircase. I like that. So, oh, there's the, re there, there's the rest of uh, Mannequin McGee. No, I hope this isn't a boss battle or something weird. Good luck. I believe in you. No, probably not. I don't think this game does boss battles. Puzzle battles, yeah. Boss battles, no. Oh, there's two cranks by the looks of it's it. It's two levers. And there's this. Too. There's four levers. So two levers on either side of him. Oh, look, it changes the symbols. Yeah. So, oh, is it the cat with an eye? There's a person with a ball. Interesting. So we've been looking at, uh, or I've been looking at apartments, I guess, to some degree. Oh, I know. I should match them. I think that's the cat, and that's the ball playing. And then this controls the inner ones, and that's good. Oh, the next floor again. Oh no. Good morning! Fancy spot of huh? cog murder? Oh, it's, it's offering... Yeah. Oh, I, I can take it? How do I take it? Wander? No, I don't think you take it. I, I think it wants something. It wants something to be placed That there. thing. That thing on the ground. This one, right. Yeah, grab it. It goes in there. 
So I've been looking at apartments and houses lately, and one of the houses that I saw looked pretty nice, but the only staircase was like this janky, like, metal railing spiral staircase right in the middle of the living room. Um, how do I bring it over? Press A, and then, yep, you got it. Okay, that was awkward. And I was like, this would be a neat place to, uh, to get it as an apartment or a house. I straight up don't remember if it was one or the other. <laughs> then I was looking at that staircase, and I'm like, I think this would just, like, one of us would fall into it, because there was no railing or anything. Like, show. imagine if there was just a, a spiral staircase just, like, three feet behind us. That's effectively what it would be. So he spins that, but we need to bring the other one to it. Yeah. In order to get it to spin. Okay. There you go, that, that seems closer. That looks better. Okay, that brought that down again. Keep spinning my gears. So then we just need to bring the clock back. Oh, but I can't mess with those anymore. Uh, try the closer lever. I thought that that try the closer lever, shall. Change the hands of the clock, though. Oh, that should bring the gears back so that I can use these levers again, right? No. No? Try spinning that. Maybe just keep spinning? No. No, we don't. No, like, re-engage the gears and then spin again and see what happens. Mm-hmm. Well, we need to get the main clock. Well, you only have two things you can interact with. Oh, there, there, there we go. Now the clock is back and set. So... There. So just keep spinning keep it. Keep spinning it until the hands are just right. Just keep spinning. Just keep spinning. Spin. There we go. Right, and like one or one two more, more times. One more time. Maybe. There you go. There we go. Shadow works. Oh. Good timing. Achievement unlocked. I wonder how long this game is. I don't know. Looks like one of those ones that'll be short and sweet, unless it's an immensely long epic. Who knows? I don't know. I love the set pieces. Don't already think of the end just as we've started no, 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 experiencing no, no. it. Well, so it's one of those where it's like, you know, this is the sort of thing I generally do as a one-off. But if it was like two hours long, I'd probably go the full way through. But if it's like 12 hours long, it's like, I don't know. Yeah, there's just creepy dolls that kind of... They well, don't really look like the protagonist. Uh-oh. What? What was that? The clock just did it. So there's a lamp. There's oh, I didn't mean to sit on the bed. There's a flopsy bed. Well, all the lamps dimmed, and these. Huh. This whole place is falling apart at the seams. I can rattle it, but I can't interact with it. Well. Oh, does this change the time of day? There's storm, there's leaf, and then there's moon. Oh, look, there's a girl standing beneath a tree. There's just a sun, sunny sky. There's thunder, oh, lightning, I see. wind. So if you head towards thun, uh, I, oh, I see. It'll change which direction you're going because you're trying to go to that door is my bet. So you're there. You want to take the route through. Oh, but look, there's lights that connect but them you and don't, that light just... You probably don't want to go through the thundery areas. No. So why don't you go uh, Autumn Leaf mm -hmm. and then go at the bottom. And then, okay, go there. Oh, we do travel through it. Yeah, so then I do Moon? Moon. Yeah. Oh, wait, 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 why does it have the other one lit? Dunno. I just try it. Okay. Yeah, there's only two moon and two autumn leaves and no, two No, no, see, thunder. we went to the right. That's not what we want. We go off a cliff and die. What? I couldn't change it. Maybe just try moon? Um. Just try moon. Maybe you, maybe you don't have to go through one or the other. But we, we can't. Just try going moon, see what happens. But look, it only lit that up. I don't believe we can go. 
We have to light the next picture in the path, which is that. Oh, this is that. Oh, I see. This way... It, it avoids is, thunder. It's blocked off. I got it. So it's... You're switching the lights back and forth. Try going again. Wait. Yeah. Okay, we yeah, went to you the right it. one. And then we want to go autumn to the Autumn leaf and then moon again. Yeah. And you're going to want to switch the thunder as well. Oh, right. We want moon. And switch the thunder. Because other... Oh. Oh. Why did it start us again? It turned off the uh, the one she was in. So. Oh, we need to take yeah. a roundabout Okay, path. so do auto, do autumn leaf and then moon. Mm -hmm. And then switch the thunder. Okay, and then go. And then go. Right, we have to go down to the moon. And then just switch the autumn leaf. Because she has to be in a lit frame. Right, but we don't want the thunder and lightning. So, uh, switch the thunder. And then go. Nope. Oh, like that. Yeah. And then we can switch to the moon. Yeah, once worrying. we're in the next autumn leaf. And then... There we go. You're good. That leads us down the next path. I guess interact with the bear? That's what I was thinking. What does he have to do with anything? Oh, does he allow you to switch it? Yeah, look at that. Um, do I need to go backwards again? So I would need like... Oh. There's an autumn projection. Autumn, moon. Oh, pay attention to the order. Oh. Autumn. So autumn. Autumn first, so just do autumn. Then moon. moon. Then autumn. Autumn. It's the one that's flashing. Yeah, so just our original moon. path. Then just moon. Okay. Ooh, its head falls off and what, there are three eggs that come out? And there's a bat. Yeah, it's a bat that's assailing the cat. And now us. Am I controlling them? Yeah. So we need... Well, that's interesting. We can tell where they move. But we also are shown where the bat moves at the same time. So we need the bell. See the halves of the faces? Yeah. But the cat hovers. Oh. Should we move them together? Sure. Okay. And then, but we need the girl to get to the other side. So maybe there. The bat moves over. The girl gets closer to the bell. Unless the bat needs to secure the bell? Or is this slowly bringing the pieces together? Maybe. She can't reach it? Does the bat have to get the bell down? Or maybe the girl and the cat. Ugh, sorry. The yeah. girl and the cat need to be together? I think you need the girl and the cat in the same place. Oh, Where is oh the bat, if it's right above you, it snags you. Yeah. Okay. Well, let's go say we do that. And we do that so that they're next to each other. And there you go. Wait, that seems to work. Okay. Now, because the bat flies over us, will that kill us? Potentially. What are your other options? The other option is to go back to the tree. 
I mean, you're gonna have to pass under the bat one way or another. I mean, what, just that again? Maybe? Yeah. So as long as it doesn't land directly beneath you, you're fine. We can't... So just, there will be a shadow of her at the door. There you go. There we go. And he fails to follow us out. Yeah. Wait, they're faces. They're people. Yeah, they're actual portraiture as opposed to anything else. There he goes. But where to? Cat. Where'd you go, cat? Not up the chimney. Hmm. Interact with the portraits. Oh yeah, there is a dot on it. How is she able to see that? Or reach that? Is it dust? It is dust. So there was a woman. She played with these puppets. Is it her mother, maybe? Oh, for a second I thought her the little girl had a knife and I was just like, what is this? And they were together, but... Oh. Oh, she was making a doll. She's making something out of paper. She has this, the brooch. Brooch. Oh, but the girl broke something. Mm-hmm. Clumsy is the achievement. Oh, I wonder if she was like a wizard, this, this and woman. And so a cult grandmother. There's the book. A cult grandmother turns her into a book. Now it, well, we have a tome. Oh. Paper dolls that fold out. That's right. Time I don't think I'd crawl. ever want to be in a house like this with like all the secret bits and whatnot. <laughs> like, imagine just pulling a lever someday and opening up a room that you've never seen before and finding like the previous occupants mummified in there or something. Oh, yeah. Don't remind me. I've seen back. During October, I was watching pretty much every horror film that there was on Netflix. And some of them were like that, yeah. It's a neat... Mm. Hello. That's a change in tone. I love the visual design of everything. It's creepy. That reminds me of an old statue of Bast that my dad has at home. Like, the just a full on cat as opposed to Bast the goddess, but... Yeah. Creepy. I like it. I wonder... And look at the eyes. I don't know. Well, this is about half an hour in. What do you think? I'm enjoying it so far, and I want to see more. Oh. I guess we'll play more then. Maybe we'll, like, dual feature this and Gris tomorrow. Or Grease, sorry. I think that'd be a good idea. For now, I guess, thanks for watching, everybody. We'll see you guys next time.